Pope Francis has also released his message for this Sunday's World Day of Prayer for Vocations. In his message, the Holy Father underlined how this day is a precious opportunity for recalling with wonder that the Lord's call is a grace and a complete gift. EWTN Vatican journalist Benjamin Crockett has more. The Vatican released the Holy Father's message for the 60th anniversary of the World Day of Prayer for Vocations. This year's theme is Vocation, Grace and Mission. World Day of Prayer will be observed on April 30th, Good Shepherd Sunday. Speakers at the conference included Cardinal Lazarus Yu Hung Sik, Prefect of the Dicastery for the Clergy, and Reverend Eamon McLaughlin, official of the same dicastery. Cardinal Lazarus Yu Hung Sik underlined how, from the words Pope Francis has chosen for this message, we can discover the very heart of the good news of the gospel. Each one of us has a place in the heart of God. No one is excluded. In his message, the Holy Father explains how no vocation exists without mission to the least and calls on the faithful to be open to fulfilling the Lord's instructions and not be challenged by existential peripheries. And so the message is really and truly um, about prayer for vocations. And I think in the various, um, you know, the various talks that were given here today, um, it's important not to forget that the message is that of prayer in particular uh, for all sorts of vocations. The Lord created each and every one of us and has a specific plan for each and every one of us. And that prayer that we come to realize that plan, to realize the Lord's love for us in our life. The common mission of all of us Christians, Pope Francis continues, is to witness with joy in every situation, with attitudes and words, what we experience by being with Jesus and in his community, which is the church. The Holy Father also touches on the importance of being merciful and creating a lifestyle which is welcoming and compassionate. The message really from the dicastery is uh, to invest all our resources possible um, to, for the pastoral care vocation, promoting vocations, encouraging vocations, and in particular that that's a synodal, very much a synodal approach, that it's the approach of the entire community, not solely, obviously, of priests, but of, of everybody, beginning with the family. In his message, Pope Francis also refers to the upcoming World Youth Day in Lisbon in August. Following Mary's example, the Holy Father hopes people attending the event in Portugal will be ready to encounter a profound experience with Jesus. In Rome, Benjamin Crockett, EWTN Newsnightly.